Photosynthesis begins in the soil, where plants take in water through their roots. As the water moves upward, the plant starts to grow, from the roots all the way to the leaves. The plant also needs sunlight, which provides the energy needed to power the process of photosynthesis. Water molecules are absorbed by the roots and travel up through the plant's stem to the leaves. Once the water reaches the leaves, the plant is ready for the next step, combining it with carbon dioxide and sunlight to make food. Now the plant has all the ingredients it needs for photosynthesis. During photosynthesis, the plant produces oxygen, which is released into the air. This is the oxygen we breathe. The plant also creates glucose, a type of sugar that it uses as food to grow and thrive. Together, sunlight, water, and carbon dioxide fuel photosynthesis, a process that keeps plants alive and helps sustain life on Earth by providing oxygen and food. Now that we know how water, carbon dioxide, and sunlight help a plant make food, let's take a closer look at where this process actually happens. Inside the plant's cells, there are tiny structures called chloroplasts. These are chloroplasts under a microscope. They're responsible for making photosynthesis happen. Inside the chloroplasts is a special pigment called chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is what gives plants their green color, and it's also what captures sunlight, making it possible for the plant to convert energy from the sun into food. When sunlight hits the chlorophyll and the chloroplasts, it starts the process of photosynthesis. Chlorophyll absorbs the sunlight and uses that energy to transform carbon dioxide and water into glucose, the plant's food. It also gives off oxygen. Let's break down the chemical equation of photosynthesis. 6 CO2 plus 6 H2O plus light energy yields C6H12O6 plus 6 O2. This means six molecules of carbon dioxide plus six molecules of water, with the help of sunlight, turn into one molecule of glucose and six molecules of oxygen. In this equation, the reactants are the substances needed to start the reaction, carbon dioxide and water. While the products are glucose and oxygen, the substances produced in the chemical reaction. To recap, photosynthesis happens in the chloroplasts, where chlorophyll captures sunlight. The plant uses water and carbon dioxide to create glucose for food and oxygen as a byproduct. This process is what powers life on Earth by keeping plants alive and providing oxygen for us to breathe. Without photosynthesis, life as we know it wouldn't exist. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe to learn more about the world of science.